The news handpicks which mass shootings to cover, usually to move forward an agenda, but there have been 210 mass shootings this year for an average of more than one a day. There were eight in the past seven days. Starting on May 17th in Palo Alto, California, when one was killed and three more injured, when residents were caught in the crossfire of two groups shooting at each other at a local park. This video was filmed by a young girl fleeing the gunfire. 34-year-old Ralph Fields, first cousin of NFL wide receiver Devontae Adams, was shot and killed. On May 18th, five people were injured in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, aged 19 to 59. Three are in critical condition and combined were hit by 22 bullets. The incident happened near Temple University and two suspects were taken into custody. On May 19th in Chicago, Illinois, two people were killed and seven injured in a shooting that occurred in front of a McDonald's after a fight. On May 20th, one person was killed and three injured in New Orleans, Louisiana, ranging in age from 29 to 59. Also on May 20th, in Highland, California, one was killed and eight injured when two shooters began firing at a large crowd celebrating a graduation party at a hookah lounge. And the third mass shooting from May 20th, in Kissimmee, Florida, where one died and three were injured, 27-year-old Jaquan Dockery was killed. On May 21st, in Tacoma, Washington, four people were injured, three females and one male aged 15 to 17 when someone in a second car fired at them. Also on May 21st in Goshen, Indiana, two were killed and three injured in what was considered likely a murder-suicide. So those are the eight mass shootings resulting in the deaths of eight and injuries to 36 others. If you like this sort of content, leave a comment, like, and consider subscribing. Support this channel and pick yourself up some original crime-related apparel. Look for the link in the description.